All right, just one more thing. We got two minutes here because I know you got to yep. go. Uh, the ranking member on the House Intelligence Panel. Um, this is uh, um, Adam Schiff. Yeah. Says uh, uh, announced yesterday that he was contemplating that the the investigate that their their committee might have to subpoena the FBI because he said I would say at this point we know less than a fraction of what the FBI knows. I appreciate right. we had a long briefing and testimony from the director today, but for order us to do our investigation in a thorough, thorough, incredible way, we're going to need the FBI to fully cooperate, to be willing to tell us the length and breadth of any counterintelligence investigations they're conducting. At this point, the director was not willing to do that. Now, this has been interpreted in two different ways, and I think legitimately so. One was that maybe Sessions was st telling the FBI, do not share this information. I'm your boss. Do not share this with the committee. Um, and is trying to stifle this investigation. And that's why uh, we saw some pushback from these intelligence agencies to leak, to give them some space to do this investigation. And or it could be, getting back to my off-the-wall theory, that Comey doesn't want to tell Adam Schiff because sitting across from Adam Schiff is the chair of the committee, this guy Nunez, who was a Trump transition official. <laughs> and right. doesn't, and it, maybe Comey doesn't want Nunez to know what's going on because he's afraid that's going to get back to uh, the Trump administration. We have no way of knowing. Right. And that's what the big, again, that's the big problem here, and those are the big issues here, is how opaque all of this is. And, you, and you, you know, again, that's what happens when we start sort of ignoring um, norms of behavior when you've got you know, Nunez himself, as well as Burr, who's the, who's the Senate Intelligence Committee, trying to sell the Trump line on that, that oh, the Russia thing's nothing, and, the, you know, and all this kind of thing to, to uh, the media. So you know, they're, they're playing that role for him. And so, I, you know, why would you – anything that goes to those guys, you, do you think that's not getting back to Trump? I mean, the, so many of these people that once were sort of, you know, whatever you think of them, at least had a loyalty to sort of the conservative end of American policy, you know, what's their – I mean, who the hell knows what their loyalties are now? Indeed. I don't know. Indeed. Hey, everybody. Sam Cedar here. Believe me, it's true. It is true, and you can subscribe to this channel by subscribing to this channel. It's true.